I went through a weird uh, time where I wanted to leave the internet. I didn't want to be a part of it. And I felt like it ruined my life. Shane Dawson is taking the good with the bad. In his first YouTube video in over a year, Shane candidly addressed his decision to take a step back from the spotlight after controversial clips featuring his use of blackface, the N-word, and other offensive comments resurfaced last year. The vlogger stated that he wanted to leave the internet and that he didn't want to be a part of the vlogging community. Shane went on to say, quote, I felt like it ruined my life. Shane also explained that before the controversy, he felt he had already learned a lot and grown past the person he was in those past controversial clips. And I think part of me was upset because I was like, I made so much growth and now I'm being canceled over things from the past. And that's not me anymore. However, all the drama helped him realize that he can't focus on what others think of him. So even though it was a really hard time in his life, Shane admitted that he learned a lot and is glad it happened to him. Showed me what I care about, showed me what matters, showed me I don't need to be on YouTube all the time. I don't need to be stressed about what's next. I don't need to be trying to think of the next idea, the next whatever, to be happy. And while Shane added that he understands why people may be upset with his return, he says that he just wants to move forward. Yeah, I'm not gonna run from my past, but I'm also not gonna stay in it. I don't want to be looked at as somebody who gave up and left and ran away from the internet because they were afraid of whatever. Now after taking that time off to figure out what he wanted to do with his life, Shane is excited about the future and his major plans to share his new life in Colorado with his followers. The YouTube star's reputation took a serious hit in June of 2020 when a clip of Shane seemingly touching himself inappropriately to a poster of a then 11 year old Willow Smith resurfaced on the internet. While he apologized about the general sexualization of minors as well as his history of all the racism that he put onto the internet. In his apology video, Jada Pinkett Smith and Jaden Smith both stated that his apologies were useless. Jada tweeted at the time to Shane Dawson, I'm done with the excuses. While Jaden tweeted, Shane Dawson, I am disgusted by you. You sexualizing an 11 year old girl who happens to be my sister is the furthest thing from funny and not okay in the slightest bit. Jaden went on to say in a separate tweet, this man was also doing blackface on the regular. As the youth, we need to support creators who support us and our morals. This is not okay. Thanks for watching E! News. Have thoughts on the story? Sound off in the comments below. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so we can keep you up to date with the latest in Celeb News Daily.